This simple burger recipe makes perfect juicy burgers at home. You can use your grill to cook them or in a skillet on your stove. I'm mixing up a little garlic powder, onion powder, salt, and pepper to sprinkle on the burgers after they're formed. To form the burgers, you're going to take the ground beef and flatten it with your two hands, and as you do that, use your thumb to apply gentle pressure to the sides of the burgers. It's important that you don't push too hard or manipulate the beef too much because the burgers can become dense and tough. Some people add breadcrumbs or eggs to their burger meat to help act as a binder to keep your burgers together, but I find that you don't need that. As long as you're using fresh ground beef, you can see that my burgers are super red, the meat is very fresh, um, and not using frozen meat, then your burgers will stick together just fine. Add the seasoning to both sides of your burger, and you're going to put them on a hot pan that's been heated on your stove. Cook the burgers for three to four minutes on medium, and then cook for another three to four minutes on the other side. You can also cover the you can also cover the pan with a lid if you want the inside of your burgers to be well done and they're not cooking fast enough. If you're going to cook your burgers on the grill, preheat your grill to high heat. Once it's super hot, turn it to low and add your burgers. I like to grill my burgers on low to medium heat because the fat from the burgers may cause flare-ups from the grill and that can char the burgers. For this recipe and more, check out my blog at timeforthetable.com.